great horse, Matt. Yeah, come a little bit forward here into the light, my dear. Good dogs. Good dogs indeed. Good driver, too. Um, we've heard a little bit about Keeper as your as your leader. Uh, maybe you could tell us a little bit about him and any other dogs that sort of stood out for you on this race. Yeah, I mean he's uh, he's the guy that, that got us here again, like uh, like my first year a couple years ago. So he led uh, he led the uh, I think 900 miles of it. I took him out for uh, for 100 miles just outside of uh, Circle for a little bit. Um, he's the, the old guy here on the crew, eight years old, he, and uh, got five, five other lead dogs in the kennel, and he's trained every one of them, so he's kind of the, the, the go-to guy. And uh, the rest of this team here is just a pretty, pretty solid group. Uh, this uh, black wheel guy here at uh, Wheel Dog there is actually Keeper's brother, and uh, they're kind of the last two of the, the original uh, Smoke and Ace kennels, my first litter. Yeah, right on what it was like going through eagle seeing yeah. family and whatnot yeah. yeah that was that was really exciting you know i've been i've been looking forward to it the whole uh the whole the whole race so far and uh knowing it was uh knowing it was coming and my folks are going to be there and uh you know just let alone all the folks in eagle too i haven't seen them in a while but it's been a long time for my parents and uh so you know i was really looking forward to that crew and uh hoping that i wasn't going to get there at a, at a crazy hour where there wouldn't be too many people that would be able to make it out but uh yeah, there was a nice crew there, lots of hugs, lots of encouragement, you know, kind of gave me that second wind in the race right before Dawson, which got me to Dawson, so that's a long stretch there before the before the 36, so yeah, I'll be looking forward to it just as much every year. 